Actually, the bike is really good stock um, out of the box. Justin really, really liked everything about it. Um, mainly everything that we've tested, we haven't found anything better than what was OEM. So we just keep running it the way it is. I mean, as far as everything goes, factory suspension, factory hubs, besides that, standard clamps. Standard brakes and master and caliper. Besides that, um, nothing changed on the actual <coughs> subframe or any of that. It's all standard. <coughs> the linkage is standard. So it's all motor and suspension that's really changed. That's all that we've really worked with this year. The new bike is a much better. You know, it's a it's a much better package just from the factory. Yeah, just mainly just um, they're bulletproof. So all we do is keep gas in it, keep lube on the chain, keep it out on the track with fresh, fresh tires. And, you know, everything else is pretty easy. He's pretty hard on the clutch, but what we'll do is we'll do all three practices, change the clutch, come back in, and put a brand new one in for the heat, and then one new one for the main. That's it. So new for this year and for, for the bike is uh, electric start Yamaha. We've been wanting to uh, keep it to where we're on a new battery inside the bike at all times. So we jump the bike in the pits just like Road Race does. So we took that from our road race team and implemented it over to the dirt bike side of racing. That we never start the bike on its own battery. More than one team has had trouble with electric start since electric start came out. And we're just trying to cover all our bases so that we can have as many, you know, <coughs> as many things to keep those problems from happening 